Okay, so let's start off first of all, just spreading your toes. So you're grounding your feet. And then I just want you to breathe. So you can just relax your arms, relax your face, and just breathing in and out through your nose. So nice, slow breath in. And out. Let's just take a little bit of time thinking about that breath. So a nice, slow, deep breath, allowing that breath to travel all the way down into your tummy, making your tummy expand forwards as you fill your whole body with breath. Think about that breath traveling sideways, expanding your ribs. Inhaling all the way down to the bottom of your lung, all the way up to the top of your lung. Breathing in through the nose, filtering warming the air so let's start with a little bit of mobility first of all just circling your wrists while you're doing that see if you can rise up and down on your toes Placing your feet back down. So this time, just shoulder roll, lifting your shoulders up, round and down. And then change direction, bring them forwards. Good. Okay, this time making a circle with both arms. and then change direction, take it the other way. And relaxing there, arms down by your sides, just a little lean from side to side. So flexing through your spine. Coming back to the center, arms out and a little twist, rotating in our spine. And then coming back to the center. So we're just gonna round our upper back, hands come forward, open those arms, open your chest, looking up. So again, a little rounding of that upper back as we come forward. Open your arms, extending in your spine, looking up. Two more. Rounding forwards, opening. Rounding forwards, opening. Good. All right, let's lifting opposite arm, opposite knee. And then relaxing there. So we're just going to slide your foot forward out to the side and in. So just making a little circle with your legs, stirring in that hip. So again, think about our posture, standing tall. One more circle that direction and then I want you to change and stir the other way around. So you can have that foot just brushing on the floor. Good, 
and then let's change legs. So again, we're just stirring your leg round, circling in your hip, standing tall. And then round the other way. Lovely. All right, we're gonna take a step back with your right foot. Just a little step back, not a big step. Foot slightly turns out, but keep your hips and shoulders facing forwards. So we're gonna bend that front knee slightly. Oh, warrior one. Take a breath in as you lift your arms up, but keep shoulders drawn down. We're just gonna hold it here and breathe. So I think feet grounded into the floor. Strong thighs, strong back. Breathing into that back. Breathing all the way down into your tummy. Breathing into the sides of your ribs under your armpit. Now let's straighten both legs. Place your hands on your ribs and just squeeze your elbows back. So I want you to think, lift your chest as you look up at the ceiling. So a little back extension. And then we're gonna fold forwards. So sliding your hands down your leg, reaching down as low as you comfortably can. Think about keeping your hips square, pulling that right hip forward, pushing your left hip back. Good. Then your knees, you come back up and step in. So let's do the same thing on the other side now. Step your left foot back, foot just slightly turned out but keeping your hips and shoulders facing forward. So let's bend our front knee, push those feet firmly into the floor, take a breath in, arms lift up strong. So imagine you're holding swords high above your head, our warrior one. We need to activate our shoulder and back muscles, heavy arms, heavy swords. And again, just breathing in and out through your nose. Place your hands on your ribs. And again, let's squeeze those elbows back and just extending in that upper back. Straightening our front leg and then leaning forwards again. your front knee as we come back in. Okay, we're going to make our way down to the floor onto our hands and knees. So our cat cow pose, tucking your tailbone and rounding your spine. So we're thinking about imagining you're a cat tucking that tail between your legs, so tucking that pelvis scooping your tummy in and just rounding your back head tucked in shoulder blades pushing apart 
And then we change position, this time lifting your tail up towards the ceiling, lifting your head. So again, let's round that back, take a breath in. And then make a little dip in your back as you breathe out. So rounding your back again as you breathe in. Breathing out, little dip in your back, head lifting. Let's do a few more of those on your own time. So just breathing in, rounding your spine, tuck your tailbone. Breathing out, tilting your hips the other way. One more each way. So just mobilizing your spine. Good. Let's come down onto your tummy then. So upward facing, a nice back extension. What I want you to do is to start off with your hands just underneath your shoulders, tuck your elbows back by your side. Now flatten your toes, but I want you to think, squeeze your bum, take a breath in as you lengthen. So you're gonna straighten your arms as much as you can. So make sure they're not too far forward. Hands can come back and that takes some of the pressure off your back. I'm just going to hold it for a few seconds and relax, push back into child's pose. So take your knees a little wider, hips sinking back as much as you can. You can rest your head making a couple of fists or you can rest your head on the floor and relax your shoulders. And again, let's think about breathing into your back, opening across your hip. Take a breath in again and let's come back up. So this time, swing your legs round in front of you as we come up to sitting. Okay, so we're gonna bend our right knee. I want you to cross your right ankle over your leg. So we're gonna try and get that foot on the floor flat if we can. And then I just want you to turn towards the left. So you can have hands wherever's comfortable for you. Think about stretching up nice and tall and really opening across your chest and shoulder as you turn to the side. Good. So we're trying to keep the front, the foot crossed over flat. Think about pushing your thigh and knee down on that long leg and opening as you twist. And release, come back to the center. We're gonna do that on the other side. So change legs, crossing your leg over, try and get that foot as flat on the floor as you can, and then keep twisting round towards the right. So think about squeezing those shoulder blades back and stretching up tall in your neck. Come back to the center again. So this time, let's take both legs out wide. Have a little wiggle back on those sitting bones. So we're gonna turn our body towards the left. 
And then you're gonna reach your right arm down that inside of your right leg. And your other hand just lifts up and over if you can. So we're flexing sideways. That's it, yeah, perfect. Come back up to the center, and this time let's slide both hands forwards. Now try not to round that back, so keep that chest open, keep that length as you lean forward. That's it. Good. And then come back up again. So let's turn our head and shoulders towards the right leg. Left arm reaches down the inside of your left leg as we reach up and over, flexing to the side. And then coming back up to the center again and relax. So let's make a bridge this time, lying on your back. Lining up ankles, knees and hips. I want you to flatten your back. Arms down by your sides. So we're going to take a breath in, lifting your arms, start to roll up your spine. Hands can either reach just up to the ceiling or you can take your arms back overhead. Breath out as we bring our arms down and roll back down your spine. So breathing in, peeling up your back, one vertebra at a time. Breathing out as you roll back down, one vertebra at a time. Let's do that one more time. Okay, so relaxing there. We're going to finish with some breathing, meditation and relaxation. So make sure you're comfortable. You can lengthen your legs. You can have legs bent, whichever's comfortable for you. And then just closing your eyes. So first of all, let's reconnect with our breath. Breathing in and out through your nose. Feeling that tummy expanding and rising, your ribs expanding. Nice, slow, full breath in and out. So just breathing in and out. Think about your feet. Point or flex your ankles and release. Squeezing your thighs. Release. Clenching your hands, tense your arms, shrug your shoulders and release. If 
Finally, your face, frown, screw up your eyes and nose, clench your teeth, and then release. Relaxing every part of your body. Gently breathing in and out. Breathing in peace and stillness. Breathing out any tension, any worries or concerns. This is your time. You've got plenty of time. Time to rest, time to relax. This is your treat, your reward. Enjoy. Cleansing our lungs, taking full breaths in and out. Body calm not rushing, your heart rate slow and steady, gently breathing. So I'm just going to be quiet for the next minute. Feeling peaceful, rested and relaxed, like you've had a long sleep. I'm just going to bring our focus back to the room. Be aware of the floor beneath you, your feet, your legs, your back and tummy, chest, shoulders and arms, your neck and head. Take a big breath in, have a stretch lengthen from fingertips to toes. Draw your knees in and just have a little hug, a little rock round in a circle, a couple of times each way. And when you feel ready, just make your way back up. 